Huh. Dragaza, the peaceful sleepy town of monsters. But tonight there is no peace. There is no sleep. Tonight there is only pirates. That's right, let's get out of here, boys. Wait just one minute. Put, put, put that treasure down right back where you found it. It belongs to the town. Gee, just put it back? I guess I could do that. Really? Nope. <laughs> How could you do this? She lost her head. That was it? Really? That sorry Doolahan was hardly worth making such an elaborate plan for. Professor! Holy monster girls, we've got a problem. Oh, hey Bernadette. Lock out of your office again. Even worse, it's pirates. They've ransacked the treasury. They're stealing everyone's money. Well, that's what happens when you go cheap on your security system. True facts. I offered to build you something nice, but no. What do you expect me to do about it? You're a mad scientist. You've got to have something in this lab that can bag us some pirates. Some kind of death ray? Anything? I don't know what you think I do in here, Bernadette, but it obviously isn't the case. What about this? This looks like a weapon. Can I borrow this? That's a chimera I've been developing. She's not a weapon. She's for household use, cleaning and such. Her name is Chelsea, the world's first synthetic monster. You build your own monster girl and you didn't give her any cool fighting powers? What kind of mad scientist are you? I'm not one at all. This is an emergency! Can't you give her something to make her super tough? Ah, uh, fine. She's pretty much done anyway. I'll just make some quick alterations. A bad mad scientist. A giant stone arm? That's great! Now give her something else, like a rocket launcher or a railgun. Sorry, but golem DNA is all I've got left. This will have to do. Fine, wake her up. They're getting away. Let me just program her brain, and she'll be good to go. Frankenstein's monster. Whoa, I'm alive! Did you make me? Are you my mother? What? No, I didn't do... Well, you can call me mom if you like. Hey, I was the one who made you. Wow, I've got two moms? And I've only been alive for a few seconds, and I'm already blessed with a loving family. <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way. Now let's go beat up some pirates. It will be a family bonding exercise. <laughs> Thanks, Professor. Bye, Mom. <laughs> right, now I've got to build another one. Do it for her. punch you. You can fight with all kinds of neat attacks with X and B. Now that dirty pirate snake is up ahead. Now it's up to you to stop her. There we go. Use left stick, left stick, RX2. No, I just want that one. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, this 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 uh, character is really funny. This whole game is really well done. Like the humor is on point. You should see some of the character, like some of the bosses you have to fight. It's so great. Getting some competing music. Okay. Not built for long distance running. 
Hey you, with the bag of treasure! Yikes! Someone caught up with me, you're a quick little... What are you exactly? I'm the bad dude who's going to beat the ever-loving dollar signs out of you if you don't give back that stolen treasure. Whoa, tough talk for such a tiny thing. You think you can beat me? Easily! Is that so? Well, too bad, I'm running away instead. Death below. Don't hit me. Get out of here. Oh, what's over there? Okay, neat. Secrets. Who are you? Hey, witchy, what are you doing all the way out here? I'm in hiding right now. I caused a bunch of trouble and my brother had to come and stop me. Now my grandma's really mad and she's scary, so I'm laying low for a while. That's rough. Yeah, you get it. You're alright. I'm gonna let you join my ranks. Wait, what? Me? Aw, uh, yeah. Ah, this outfit smells like fertilizer. <laughs> That's my spare robe I usually use for gardening. It will have to do. Now you can spread chaos in my stead. Go punch something. Make sure you tell them I made you do it. <laughs> yes, fertilizer outfit. What better smell? Quick. Down, up, click down, up, hour. Hey, he throws stuff. Oh man, I need to learn how to kill these guys better. No, don't steal my treasure! Ready thy fist of fury. Oh, I wonder if that's how you do it. I don't have to collect it again, but more money. the end of the line and you're still following me of course you're corner now give back the money you stole just give it back i'd be a very poor pirate if i just went and gave it back no you're going to have to beat every last penny out of me this can certainly be arranged he's very easy Correct. No, I want that those coins. Phew, for such a tiny thing you really pack a punch. I didn't think this sleepy island would have someone so tough. Well it didn't until just now. Too bad you're not as smart as you are strong. Maybe then you would have noticed that I'm just the decoy. <gasps> Hey, who are you? What are you doing? Oh, no! Alright, girl. 
Tails, let's get out of here. Make sure you follow the plan, see? Who knew this tiny island would have so much loot? We did. That's why we're here in the first place. Now it's all ours! All I had to do was lead any would-be heroes out into the wilderness and my fellow pirates would do the rest. Have a good dinner, Livid. We've been rused! Now I'll let you have this victory, but don't think this is the last you've seen of me, girl. B rank, not bad. I'm going to put one of these because I love the song. The real Chimera starts here. Welcome to Ragaza. We're a town of monster folk. A long time ago, before monsters had the same rights as humans, Ragaza was a sanctuary for peaceful monsters. But that age is long gone, and now it's just another regular town that happens to be full of cute monster people. Oh, you know what? I forgot to change the ticker. I haven't seen your face around, you must be new to town. If you want a super quick tour of town, let me know. I heard you've become quite the star in town after chasing off those pirates. This makes me mad because I'm supposed to be the star around here. I mean, look at me. I'm even shaped like a star. Well, almost. Oh, he doesn't have, like, an arm on one side. It's unfortunate that that Naga got away. I'm sure we can capture the others, though. I believe in you. It's Bernadette's... It's Bernadette's desk. It's locked, though. Oh, rip. Aren't you a cutie? When you're finished beating up those dreadful pirates, you should apply to work at my cafe. You would look stunning in one of our uniforms. Actually, I'll give you one right now. That way you'll be officially employed. Hooray. Another outfit. Oh, and there's a Halloween outfit, and then there's the DLC one that I got. <laughs> I like the face. <laughs> oh, this pirate business reminds me of the days of my youth. When I was a young ghost, before I settled down to work at the treasury, I would sail the high seas in search of treasure. Oh, the things that I saw. Down south, there's an island called Vista Island. Heck of a dangerous place. I barely escaped the island's jungle with my afterlife. Recently, I've heard they had an incident down there. Some big ghost or something of the sort. Apparently, some kid came out of the jungle, beat it up, and that was that. Amazing. I wonder if that's a Mario reference. Hello there, friend friend. My name is Nyazion. I'm a cat. I've been in the business of writing short biographies for a little while now. Unfortunately, when the pirates attacked, we had a little run-in. Some got lost, stolen, or, uh, misplaced since then. I've seen you coming and going for a little while now. If you happen to find any of my logbooks on your adventure, I'll let you read them as a reward. Just come see me anytime. Well, what a coincidence. I have one. Thanks for keeping a lookout for my logbooks. 
As promised, you can read them anytime you like. Felsia. Species Chimera. Age a few days. Favorite food? Pizza. Created from the from whatever DNA the professor had lying around. Chelsea is the world's first synthetic chimera. Her brain was pre-programmed to be able to function in everyday life. Chi Chelsea was not meant to be a hero, but some last-minute changes to her DNA and program made her into a formidable fighter in no time. Chelsea is actually left-handed, so using her right hand to fight is a little confusing for her. Bottom rung pirate. Personality clumsy. Specialty tripping. Favorite pirate serpentina. The floofs are a hard working species that will do almost anything if the pay is right. It's no surprise that the sea spiders can keep so many of them under their employment. Floof spiders do most of the low level grunt work on the ship, like cooking and cleaning. They used to also serve the food, but they kept tripping. <laughs> Greetings, resident. Regazo Department of Statistics Director, Mini Max at your service. Chelsea. Chimera, one days old. Characters collected, enemies defeated, levels completed. Items defeated. Oh, times defeated, food eaten. And superpowers updating statistics in real time. Yo! This skeleton guy is dope. I haven't seen your face around here before. Who are you? If you're not in charge of doing anything about those pirates, then kindly remove yourself from my presence. But I am in charge of beating up pirates. Well, that is an entirely different situation altogether. Those blasted pirates broke into my vault and stole all of my, uh, I mean, the town's money. Every last bloomin' cent. Yeah, I see where their money goes. This is an economic crisis. See to it that you bring back any and all treasure you find on your hunt for those scallywags. I'm... No, the entire town is counting on you. But especially me. Cigars and calcium supplements aren't cheap. This guy corrupt AF. Oh, this, this guy's cool. You want... You can just exit a stage whenever you like. Just pause the game. You even keep whatever collectibles you found along the way. That's cool. <laughs> to the east is the fairy domain. Usually when something like this happens, the fairy queen will intervene. I wonder if something happened. This well I'm sitting on doesn't actually work anymore. We've purified running water from the ocean instead. The professor actually set it up. Electricity and internet too. It was originally for the humans working on the oil rig just south of the island, but they put us on the grid as well. Most of the humans who worked the oil rig left when it dried up. Just the professor remained. I guess he liked it here. Some of the island's locations have been blocked off by those pirates. I think they're hiding treasure there. If that's the case, I imagine there's a way to unblock those areas set up somewhere. This is one of my favorite characters. She just has a mouth on the face. Our customer, how can I help you? Oh, you don't have any money. I'm sorry, but I can't sell you anything. <laughs> These are so cute. Plush dolls of popular video game characters line the shelves. They're a big hit with the kids. Hey, if you want something to eat, you need to be able to pay. We're not allowed to keep track of tabs. If you want a free sample, the boss is out in the island somewhere handing them out. It's a lot better than the trash we serve here. Berg, the peas, a spider ah, uh. <laughs> wingish, rutsundre, rutsundre, rut rutsundre. 
Hey, do you want to do a bird a favor? Yeah, I'll do a bird a favor. The shopkeeper to the left, her name is Mouthface. <laughs> her name is Mouthface. <laughs> She's super shy. If you look at her long enough, she'll get nervous and give you something for free. If you bring it to me, I'll make it worth your while. That's great. I love Mouthface. I'm staring at you. I'm still staring at you. I'm really staring at you. She's still here, what do I do? She's staring right at me. Stare. She's still looking at me, why is this happening? Maybe if I give her something she'll go away. Since you've been such a f fabulous customer, I wanted to give you this. P please stop by again. Please go away. Hooray! Mouth face, so adorable. Some kind of rice donut? This is what you wanted? Yeah, that's the one. In return, I'll give you a hint. There's this chimera who wanders around town talking to random people. They say you can tell her to do something and she'll just go and do it. No questions asked. <laughs> what a sap. Ha, what a sap. Hey, wait a second. Hey! You're not too sharp, are you? Now I just feel bad. <laughs> Here, I'll give you something nice for giving me a good chuckle. Thanks. A little pepper? A red pepper. It's hot to the touch. Who could use this? Huh. The shop here has great weapons. I'm a witch and also very small, so I can't really use these big swords. But, but I can look, right? I can dream, right? You absolutely can. You're like that chimera professor made who's beating up all the pirates, right? Too bad. I would be selling a lot more weapons if more pirates were still at large. Um, occupied. Well, who's Captain Crunch here? I heard there are pirates roaming around the island. Do you know anything about this? If I weren't retired, I'd personally sail out to their ship and deal with them myself. They used to call me Captain Punch. Because I would fight off pirates with my bare hands by Captain Punch. Got it. Release. Contact the Bank of Ragaza for releasing details. We'll build to suit. Pie fortunes. Hello, friend. The pies have foretold your arrival. I give out pie, pie-related advice, and not pie-related fortunes. My advice changes every day, so stop by again if you don't plan to beat the entire game in one sitting. Which you shouldn't. This would not be very healthy. Please rest often and enjoy the game at a relaxed pace. You're talking to me again, so you must really want one of my ultra-fast tours. Well, alright, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, that was fast! Please come again soon. Oh, alright. Oh, I have my made up bit on now. This one's my favorite boss. <laughs> oh, that worked.
Oh, I want to go back up there. Dang it. Huh, she's wearing a parka. That's adorable. Something over there? Aha! No! Oh, hello. You found a captured fairy. The pirates seem to have kidnapped a ton of them. It's probably in your best interest to save them. Oh, thank you. Little demon. <laughs> right. Burger. <clears throat> yes. Ready for best monster waifu boss? Oh, not yet. Okay. No! Take out the trash. Rising lava. Okay, here we go. Best monster ever. So you're the Chimera trying to take back our treasure. You've picked the wrong pirate to come up against. I'm one of the Sea Spider's top generals, Anchovy the Slime. You'll rue the day you ever crossed- Excuse me, sorry to cut you off, but are you a pizza? Uh, well, yes, half pizza, actually, on my dad's side. This is amazing, I can't believe it. My very own pizza slime? I'm definitely keeping you. <laughs> Wait, what? No, you're not supposed to be getting excited. You're supposed to be intimidated. 
I had an entire dialogue ready. And what's this about keeping me? I'm a pirate. I'm the scourge of the high seas, not a pet. You keep talking, but all I hear is, Please snack on me. I am soft and filled with marinara only for you. My marinara filling is not for you. <laughs> Best monster girl. Ah. Pizza Punisher. My marinara filling is not for you! We had to freeze that slime to the floor of her cell so she couldn't escape, but we finally got her, thanks to you. I've extracted some of her DNA for processing. With it, I was able to make an enhancement for your body. Allow me to introduce the Saucy Shot. With the Saucy Shot, you can charge up by holding X. Release it. Release it to fire pizza sauce projectile. Can I eat the sauce? Please don't. It's very high in saturated and trans fats. <laughs> that pizza slime is a heart attack waiting to happen. Now, on to the genetic manipulation. This might hurt a lot. <laughs> the picture. Give the DNA a little time to take effect. Your new ability will be ready by the time you get back out in the field. The saucy shot is slow, but it should be useful in taking out enemies from a distance. <laughs> I missed a lot of collectibles from these levels. This level's hard. Let's go see the, the fairy's domain. Let's get moving. Uh... Whoops. <laughs> ah, every time! Uh-huh. Uh, welcome, stranger, to the Fairy's Domain, Morgana Island Division. Unless you're a pirate, in which case you are absolutely not welcome at all. A pirate? Not me, I'm actually working on stopping them right now. Well, 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 that's a different situation entirely. Actually, maybe you can help me with something. You see, usually when there's a problem on the island, I could whip up some magic and do away with it. But I get most of my power from my followers, so without my fairy friends, I'm not much use. If only those run pirates didn't sneak up on me like the dirty cheaters they are, I could have easily handled them myself. So what I'm trying to ask you is, if you see any fairies on your travels, can you please free them? If you can return all my fairies to me, I promise I'll reward you. It will be a very good reward, maybe even the best. I can keep an eye out. You will? That's great! Stupendous! Perfect! I'll have to get out the real big spellbooks for your reward. Happy hunting! I was back here slacking off when the pirates snatched us all up. If I come around now, the queen will know I was loafing around. So don't rat me out, okay? <laughs> Secret. Uh, I guess.
Oh, neat. I found a secret by accident. From the deepest forests to the tallest mountains, where there's food to prepare, you'll find me there. It's time for Gourmet Gal, master artisan of the kitchen, at your service. If you're looking for a delicious meal, jam-packed with protein, vitamin B6, and precious cholesterol, then look no further than chicken. Bake it, fry it, rotisserie it, it doesn't matter, serve it with potatoes or on a bun. Chicken is always the true dish of champions. This specific dish I have here has been breaded, deep fried, and seasoned with my own secret blend of herbs and spices. After just one bite, you'll never be able to look at chicken the same way again. Bon appetit! Nom 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 nom. I hope you enjoyed your meal. And like that, I'm gone! I wish I had my own gourmet gal to make me food. Beetle, beetle, beetle. Oh, wow, that took her out one hit. Pizza tax, no joke. Oh, crap. 
Watch your step. Oh crap. Ooh, that was a close one. thing earlier sorry I had to miss it I'm gonna go back and watch it I'm just over here beating up monster girls ah so you're the one making a mess of my beautiful airship you finally show yourself hey sorry about your skyboat thing but you've got a bunch of treasure and stuff that doesn't belong to you so I'm gonna have to take it back Zor brother! Skyboat. The Albatross is no mere skyboat. She's the jewel of the captain's fleet. She is a marvel of engineering and technology. Yeah, so so uh, you guys played Drawful too, right? And uh, what else did you guys do? Uh, she could qualify to be the eighth wonder of the world. How dare you call her a skyboat? Do you have any idea how amazing this ship is? It was uh, not bad, but not as good as Scribble. Yeah. Scribble was really fun. That was really nuts. Um, yeah, being monster goes. Well, I guess I could see the convenience of having an, a nice cloud canoe. It's a little big, though. Not hard to find it. That's it. I have had enough of your sass. This one's a bird, but the last monster girl we fought was a pizza. <laughs> like, just a literal pizza. And I got a marinara shot power from her. Take my marinara shot. Oh no, those goggles were prescription. I can't see a thing without them. Let's call a timeout for now, okay? This doesn't mean you won or anything. Just give me a second here. Oh, where are they? I broke them. With my marinara sauce attack. B. Neat. I was able to extract DNA from that harbor you defeated. I must say that without her glasses, she's really quite harmless. Probably won't do Drawful again, but it was okay. I'm glad that it was at least fun. I mean, I did hear a lot of laughing. I was hanging out for like 15 minutes or so before I had to leave, but yeah, it looked pretty fun. I must say that without our glasses, she's really quite harmless. Still, ended up making her a new pair. We four eyes need to stick together after all. Anyways, with this Harpy DNA, I was able to fashion a new part for your body. Allow me to introduce the Harpy Boost. Give me the lowdown, Doc. Harpy Boost will launch you straight upwards. Its speed will let you reach new heights. Hold your arm up and you'll have the ingredients for a powerful vertical attack. Now on to the genetic manipulation. This might hurt a lot. I'm sure it was still a really good stream though, because you're a really funny dude with your streams. Marinara, that's right. Give the DNA a little time to take effect. Your new ability will be ready by the time you get back out into the field. The Harpy Boost will let you quickly climb vertically or attack enemies above you. Just jump while holding L-Stick up. You can only do this while on the ground.
Yeah, I imagine that thing could- that kind of thing would get a, a little boring thing. Shit posty. I like how it got blocked. This wasn't quite a shit- Yeah! Uh, I'm sure there's better games out there for it. Um, I'll definitely keep an eye on some kind of shit posty games. Unfortunately, the really shit posty ones are banned on, on Twitch. It's really quite sad. Oh yeah, don't worry about it. I am not a PG channel. <laughs> it was just Autobot. Uh, it's a little touchy sometimes. Get, get out of here. Freaking, what the hell? Take this. Yeah, that's right. Marinara shot, bitch. It's freaking red ass bugs. Cool. I can't wait to watch it, dude. I get that thing up there. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, I just realized I have a delay set on OBS, so I could cut the cable in case anything uh, ban-worthy happens. But in hindsight, it makes it very difficult to communicate with people in real time. You got KFC dating sim? Yes! KFC dating sim sounds great. Green screen Fortnite? That sounds horrible. <laughs> With the Gmod missing texture instead of green. Okay, I see, I see. I'm doing great, thanks man. How are you doing? <laughs> I was just streaming some Mario Bros because uh, we were having a little competition on who could finish it the quickest. And then uh, after I beat it, I switched to this game. So yeah, in OBS, there's a, a feature where you can delay your stream for up to however many seconds you set. And you could set a hotkey so that it not only stops the stream, but it gets rid of anything in the delay too, so you can immediately cut it before it airs. So if there's any, like, boobies on the stream, or, like, some troll comes in and says, like, uh, purple striped yellow people should all die, then, like, you can cut that so you don't get banned. Yeah. The, the only downside is it delays your chat, so, I mean, because you're delaying the stream. Like, take for instance the uh, kind of out-of-order response I'm having to these questions. Cool, good to hear you're doing good. Doing well. Is that a musical note? What the frick? Get out of here! Musical note-ass fish. How's May? The adorable fluffy May. Sauce, bitch. Doesn't bother me, but I could see the delay making stuff tricky. Yeah. 
I mean, I have mine on a whopping three seconds, so... I could probably, like, turn that down a bit and just know to hit the right button really quickly. Currently exploring the backyard. I wonder what treasures she'll find. She seems quite content. That's not good. <laughs> Hooray! I opened up something. Don't you have a cat too? Like a June bug? That was a kitty. Get wrecked! Aha! From the deepest forest to the tallest mountains, where there's food to prepare, you'll find me there! She's gonna find a pizza when she returns indoors. It's time for Gourmet Gal, master artisan of the kitchen, at your service. Just eat all the pizza first before she finds it. For centuries, we've lived off of the bounty of the sea. Oh, you have two cats? Oh. What's wrong with the other one? Camera shy? From fish to octopus, mussels to crabs, the ocean is a smorgasbord of ingredients for my delectable creations. But in this humble chef's opinion, no beautiful sea creature is more delicious than the noble squid. Trying to attack your headset wire. Rip headset wire. We knew you so well. This fried calamari is jam-packed with iron and protein. I've breaded and salted this exquisite e exquisite. Exquisit specimen just for you. Oh, that's worse than my puns. Usually I would recommend dipping it into soy sauce, but I'm just gonna throw it into your mouth as it is. <laughs> Here it comes. That was extremely suggestive. I hope you enjoyed your meal, and like that, I'm gone! The other cat's too fat to get through the gate! <laughs> That's, that's kind of funny. That's sad, but funny. Oh, what's over here? Oh, nothing's over there. She can't get into or out of your room? Oh. <laughs> Bat cat. Pizza. What kind of pizza did you get? I really want pizza right now. Probably be on stream a fair bit when you move out. Oh yeah. So how's that going? I know moving out is like so freaking hard to do, but once it happens, it's so amazing. Just don't need an angry cat stuck in your room. Aha. You made a you made a fat pepperoni pizza? That sounds fucking amazing. I had to drop the F bomb for that. Huh. Weird. That as in rising crust? How big is it, like, a foot tall? Look who's here, boys! It's a chimera! Come to crash the party! 
I can't believe an entire platoon of you worthless sea dogs couldn't keep one little roughneck from getting all up in my face. How annoying. This island hasn't been very much fun so far. If you didn't steal all the island's money, then I wouldn't have to be all up in your face right now. Well, if you didn't have so much money, I wouldn't have to steal it. How would I? Yeah, show Pacifica some respect. She came all this way to steal your grubby cash. You should be grateful. Now, now, boys, the dirty chimera does have a fair point, you know. But if she wants her treasure back, she's going to have to fight me for it. Probably not moving out for a long while. Done with uni. Try to be... Yeah, that's that's the ultimate struggle, is... I, I have faced the same thing. It's a... University definitely makes you, like, less capable of taking care of yourself, really. And then especially when you're trying to be self-sufficient, it's really difficult. So I get that. But I hope it works out well for you, dude. And I hope it happens, you know, sooner than... Or at least as soon as possible. You wish it was just a normal-sized pizza? You feel scammed? But you got more pizza! It's taller now! Try not to go down too quickly. At least make it interesting for me. Like, thick pizza? Mmm. The thick caca? T-H-I-C-C pizza? Mmm, put that shit in my mouth. like dancing. Right. Uh -huh. Oh, what? That's not how physics work. Yeah, eat marinara sauce. Mermaid Mingler. 97. Rank B. And no death. Took a little work, but we were able to pull that mermaid from the sea. She's a lot less trouble on land. This is true, it is slightly larger. All of this has really put me in the mood for some sushi. Maybe we'll order takeout tonight. Oh, stop making me hungry. Anyways, with the mermaid's DNA, I was able to synthesize another ability for you. Let me introduce the mermaid anchor. Just press B while holding left stick up to transform your golem hand into an anchor. What the hell? It's great for hitting things above you. It will even go through thin platforms to hit an enemy. Whoa, I didn't realize anchors were so useful. Now, onto the genetic manipulation. This might hurt a lot. The hell? <laughs> Give the DNA a little time to take effect. Your new ability will be ready by the time you get back out, um, back out into the field. The mermaid anchor hits hard. It will KO most of your foes in a single hit. <laughs> I missed some collectibles in the other ones. Get to punching. This is some Mega Man shit right here. Alright, well, I wish you the best of stream, but I'm gonna go back to work now that I got my. Yep! Do that, dude. Better enjoy that shit, too. Have a good one. Thanks, I will. Wah! Ah! What's with the waterworks, crab cake? I got tired of living in this stupid cave, so I ran away from home. But there are scary pirates everywhere and I just want to go back home. But I can't! I guess I'm going that way. I guess I'm going that way. I can take you with me if you promise to stop crying. Okay! I'll get on your back then. Wait, what? Ah, you're digging into my back! I'm sorry that my freakish crab hands inconvenience you. 
Just think of it as a very thorough back massage, and it will all be over before you know it. Just money, that's it. Oh, that was horrible. Squids. What? Dad, I'm home! Scuttle, where on earth did you go? I was worried sick. I ran away from home, but it was scary, so this nice girl brought me back. What? Why would you even think to do such a thing? Are you unhappy? Do I not provide enough for you? Living here is boring. We don't even have cable TV. There's so much more to do in town. I want to live there. But we have everything here. We have nice rocks to sit on and the sun to keep us warm. The sun is boring, Dad. I want to play video games and do stuff with other kids. The sun is pretty boring. I had no idea you felt this way. If only I had listened. Does that mean we can move? Absolutely not. Now go to your room. This is so unfair. Wah. As for you, thank you for bringing my daughter home safe. I don't have much, but maybe this will help you. I found it in the caves a while back. Yeah. You've received the sturdy feet. When you're hit, you will not be knocked back as far. Nice. Stage clear. Clears water. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -da. Okay, let's see. Got everything there. Missing three things from there. Three from there. From there. Uh, uh, oh, there's two stuff at my house. Two stuff. Two things. Pizza! I got one thing. Old VHS tapes line the shelves. None of them have their original sleeves anymore. Some appear to be old movies, others are just labeled with dates and numbers. Must be science stuff. I should sneak in a couple video games while the professor isn't looking. Cake Boy? We get to play a game in the game. That's so freaking cool! I love crap like this. Move this boy! <laughs> Move this boy! Doors. You can't jump as high while holding an item. Avoid these. Oh, oh, collect these. Avoid these. Bring that to there. Use that to break that. Watch out for dark cake. He will take your cake. Use bombs to get it back. It is up to you to save cake land from an uncakey fate. No cake left behind. <laughs> Some really easy tutorial levels. Mm -hmm. 
And you only use that one once? Is that what that is? Where's the cake? Oh, it was in that. Okay. Pretty cool. I like how my lives are boy. Just materialized. Do they come back after a while? Yeah, I figured I'd die. He's That's messed up. That was literally an unsolvable level. Oh, he stole the pizza, or the cake. Give me that cake back. Can you get- oh, I gotta kill him. Crap. Oh, he's up there now? One second left, I didn't even notice. Top cake. Nice joke there. Oh, I dropped on top of those. You can't jump on top of those. Just not with cake. Huh. I ran out of boys. Z. Skulkos. Ah, I got more than Cake Boy. The Witches, Gora, Luna, Rutsubo, El Pres, Estelia. Oh, Cake. Neat. This game sucks. <laughs> <laughs> this is the lab. The door is still broken. This is the professor's room. I'm not allowed inside. This is the bathroom. I don't have to go right now. This door goes down in the basement. It's full of important machinery that is too loud to keep in the lab. I'm on the internet. Nobody- oh, on the internet. Nobody knows you are a chimera. <laughs> Naho shot? Naho shoj? Mono shoj? Pizza? Boy band? <laughs> 
fishing video game. Jumping on my bed. There's another secret here somewhere. Pizzas. Huh. Wonder if I have to beat the high score for the second one or something. It's you, the Chimera, right? You're tough for a dirty peasant. I wasn't expecting this trip to be any fun, and now here I am in prison again. In my opinion, a trip isn't a trip unless someone gets arrested. You're glad you lost? Well, I could have gone without the concussion and broken ribs, but it was still a good fight. I hadn't had a fight like that in that fun in a while. I guess beating things up is pretty fun. See, that's the spirit, and the fighting is only the icing on the cake. There's the planning, and the scouting, the hasting. The sea shanties, the stories, seeing new places, trying new food, being a pirate is a blast. Sure, I'm in jail now, but this will just be another story for when I'm back home on the ship with the rest of the crew. That sounds pretty alright. What am I saying? Am I seriously considering being a pirate? But she makes it sound so fun. I, I gotta go. You're doing great so far. There's only one more boss pirate still hiding on the island. Oh, boss pirate still hiding on the island. I can't believe someone as talented as yourself was created by the professor. Why exactly was he making you anyways? Is he that lonely that he had to build his own daughter? If he just asked, I could have kept him company. Oh, it's you. Did you come to relish in your victory? Or maybe you wanted to beat me up again? I'm just passing through. Sorry about your goggles. Eh, yeah, whatever. The doctor guy gave me an eye exam and made me a new pair of glasses before they locked me up. And they let me keep my laptop, so I guess it isn't so bad. For a stupid tiny island, your Wi-Fi is surprisingly fast. <laughs> what are you watching? Oh, it's called My Ordinary Life as a Teenage Girl Who is Also a Bird. Nice. Nice anime reference. It's like a cartoon from Japan. Ah, oh, one of those anime things. The professor says that he's going to let me watch them when I finish beating up all of your friends. He says that in order to be integrated into society, I need to be properly cultured. Well, if I ever get out of here, maybe we can watch them together. As long as you promise to stop stealing treasure, then I guess we could be friends. I'll consider it. Adorbs. And then the, the pizza. The pizza slime. Oh, it's you. No, you can't have a taste. I'll pass. Food is suddenly a lot less appetizing after it tries to kill you. Though I guess drowning in muzzle cheese would be a good way to go. Well, if it's not my body you want, then what is it? I I'm not giving you any information on the sea spiders. I don't know. I'm just stopping by to see what you'd say. It's what protagonists are supposed to do, I think. You expect me to believe you? You're no different from anyone else I've ever known. Everyone always wants something. Even the other pirates, they look at me like I'm just another meal to them. The snake drools when we're in meetings. The ship's cook is constantly trying to get my recipe. 
The captain herself even tried to eat me before she decided to recruit me. No matter how tough and intimidating I act, nobody ever takes me seriously. Gosh, I had no idea being a pizza was so difficult. Oh, did I just say all of that out loud? Listen here, Chimera, I've got a reputation to keep up. If you dare breathe a word about this to anyone, I will find you and I will drown you in pineapple topping. Do you understand me? Sure, anything you say, your secret is safe with me. Oh, and thanks for listening, I guess. Adorable. Pizza slime is my waifu. Oh, there's so many articles. I'll read them another time. <laughs> I've been meaning to finally move into town, but I couldn't find a suitable home. I think this will do nicely. Hey <laughs> hey. Hey, they're here. I just cried until my dad eventually caved in. Now we live here. Finally, I get to play this ice demon everyone is always telling me about. Secret. Oh, it's you. You don't have to hit. I'm not a pirate anymore. You've been beating up all the captain's best pirates. Nobody's ever gonna be able to do nobody's ever been able to do that before. Because of this, a lot of pirates are abandoning the captain and going home. So I decided to stay in this town. It's really nice. This means we're friends now, right? This means you're not going to hit me, right? Hi, face mouth. Please stop harassing me. <laughs> I eventually caved and came into town. It isn't so bad here. It turns out that there are rocks to sit on and a sun to bathe in here too. Who would have known? Captain Punch. I think I'm going to probably just end the stream here and head on over to Crotus's channel. I'm assuming he's still streaming. Let me check. Twitch.tv Yep. Danganronpa to Goodbye Despair. Okay. Yippers. Well, thanks guys for stopping by. It was really fun. It was fun to uh, play Super Mario Bros. and learn all the secrets. And then it was fun to switch over to a more lighthearted game. Something that's not as difficult. And also, pretty funny. So, thanks for checking it out, guys. I uh, will end the stream here. I hope you all have a great weekend and a great night. <laughs>